A major milestone for affordable housing in the city as Mayor Pugh hosts a ceremonial bill signing. Thank you for staying with WJZ. I'm Mary Bubala. And I'm Denise Koch. The multi-million dollar Affordable Housing Trust Fund is about more than revitalizing the city. Political reporter Pat Warren looks at what the bill means for low-income residents. This bill signing ceremony makes it official. We must make sure that we're accommodating housing for everyone who wants and lives in this city. Baltimore is moving forward to make homes sweeter homes where city residents need it most. People should not have to be defined by their income uh, or their ability to pay. WJZ's Denise Koch took a walking tour with the mayor this summer of areas that are already getting attention. More than 4,700 new units of affordable housing have gone up in Baltimore with more work underway. Yes, about this? yes absolutely. I'm ecstatic about it. As long as they keep moving, we'll keep moving. Funding comes from the Affordable Housing Trust Fund signed into law today, as well as the governor's $75 million core project and grants and tax credit incentives for developers. We're going to do real change. We want real change because we want you to see the change. The mayor says it's not just about what the city looks like in two or three years. It's about what Baltimore will be in decades to come. And the Affordable Housing Trust Fund is instrumental in achieving that change. So with that, thank you.